Nets back. Team Black. Let's freaking go. But what's up, everyone? We're back with another reaction. And this time, we are going to be watching Season 2, Episode 1 of House of the Dragon. The wait... Wait was, was long, but we made it, and words can't describe how excited I am to be, to be here right now in front, of my, in front of my computer screen, about to get more. But yeah, this should be epic. Season one as a whole was perfect. Actually, like unbelievable how good season one turned out to be. But yeah, I loved it. The finale, of course, was packed, and we ended it off with some shit. Um, but yeah, that whole dragon chasing scene with Aemond and, what does that do? what was the dude's name, Lucerus, I think, Rhaenyra's kid, um, but yeah, that whole scene was beautifully done, and then, of course, mistakes were made, life was lost, and payback will be a motherfucker, uh, but I, I also love that very end shot of Rhaenyra and her face, and just how angry she looked there. But yeah, it's on. Once again, this is going to be so crazy. I do know the episode is called A Son for a Son. So yeah, it's about to go down. And Aegon, Aemond, watch your backs. Watch your backs. We're ready. Full reactions will be over on my Patreon page. Link to that will be in the description box of every video over here on YouTube. If you want to check them out, feel free to hit the link and do so. That being said, we're jumping into it. Let's go. Now it's real. Let's go! Get Aegon the fuck off that throne. Duty is sacrifice. Mm. All men of Winter honor fell. must pay its price. Oh my god. North owes a great duty to the Seven Kingdoms. The first men, we have stood as guardians against the cold and the dark. The Night's Watch cultivated its strength from doomed men. Sester, Torrin Stark began a tradition by making an offering at the onset and men from our household was to be chosen to fortify the watch. It's not a sentence, but an honor. Mine own kin. God, I love this. I love the north. Winter is coming. Winter. Coming. It's summer snow, my prince. I love them already. It pleases me to think that over a century ago, our ancestors treated in this very place, the conqueror and the king in the north. At least. Had the mercy not to threaten me with your dragon. Torrin Stark would have sooner died than bent the knee. Unless he believed the Conqueror could bring unity to the Seven. I write in that. That unity is now threatened itself apart. If men do not remember the oath sworn to King Viserys. Damn right. Starks do not forget their oaths, my prince. And sir, my duty to the wall is even more dire than the one I owe to King's Landing. I need my men here. Mother is to defend her claim. To hold the realm united, she needs an army. War is coming. To the whole of the realm wage it without the support of the north. Father brought King Jaehaerys and Queen Alessandra to see the wall. This very outlook. And watched as their dragon power in the world refused to cross it. My ancestors built a 700 foot wall of ice to keep out snow and savages. What does it keep out? Death. Oh! Damn. I have thousands of grey beards who have already seen too many winters. But they're old. <laughs> I can ready them to march at once. Grey beards can fight, the Queen will have them. They will fight hard. It's arrived. Urgent news from Dragonstone. <sighs> Such a fantastic opening scene. Winterfell. Stop. Take your mount again. We're flying out. This must gorge and rest. As must I. We're going to King's Land, killing Vagar. I cannot face that. My dragon and yours together, we can kill Vagar and her rider. Make it a son for a son. Was this the Queen's command? The Queen remains absent, but I must instead remain here to wage her war. 
Or perhaps more simply, to Kyber await her. Long she is exposed. She is grieving. We need the mother We need time. The... We need... It was a raven that bore me news of Lena's death. For weeks, in torment. Refusing to believe only when I saw my daughter's mortal remains that I could begin to mourn her. A raven has told Rhaenyra that her son is dead. She needs to know it for certain. She was a fool to go alone. If Aemond were to happen upon her. Then I would pity Aemond. The queen was wise to recuse herself. Chills. She's God the dang. In fact, it when you had the chance. Aegon's line would be extinguished. Yeah, yeah. But we don't talk about the past. Bye with me. It is a command. Would that you were the king. What the fuck? That face is haunting. That face almost made me cry there. Not like this. My lord. It's a marvel she was able to return from the Stepstones at all. To have my ship back at sea. To lead the effort. It will be many weeks yet. A word with my brother. To see what reinforcements the shipwrights can muster. The smithy delivered this earlier. I had this commission for Prince Lucerus. Well, heir's death. It was the blackest of treacheries. They tell me that you're the one that dragged my body out of the sea. It was only my duty. I am indebted to you, Alan. Find your post! Yes, 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 Dragon! Arm the scorpion! Bring it around! Get ready! God. Hold! Better hold. Stand down, it's my guard! Stand down! Hold oh, no. on. Where is your Harris? Do you need of him? Take him into the small council. He'll be king one. He does not want to be king. Where is he? Bree, you must not interrupt his custom. I'm afraid. Bree, they'd be fools to come with Vagar protected. Not the dragons. The rats. The queen is an enduring mystery. Not need to be seeing all this. There's a chill in the air. We're expected at the small council, Your Grace. We cannot. Again. Thank you. Yes, Your Grace. The last we brought off to. If you wouldn't mind. <clears throat> your Grace? Good day. <laughs> Good morrow, my lords. Mother. As to the Vale and to the north, <laughs> continue to go unanswered. Cunts. <laughs> One declaration. My brother, but we... It's like, we're it's playing! My letters to Rhaenyra, has there been any answer? An apology for her dead son? None of their blockade of the gullet, we must presume that the princess has refused the offered terms. War is now inevitable. <laughs> Enough! In hopes that new terms might not might be... Needed. Is the heir to the throne bothering you, Tyland? No, not in the least, Your Grace. Because I think he wants a ride. A pony ride. Wouldn't that wow. be your royal steed? Yeah. <laughs> he, he damn sure should be. Your Grace. Get to it. <laughs> there are important matters. No time for amusements, Thailand. Darn. Rhaenyra's blockade has placed King's Landing under strain. And we should have just killed her when we had the chance. Regrettably, the opportunity for surprise has been... We must play the board before us. We could offer the title to the young Lord Dalton Greyjoy. Aemond. King summoned me. You do not have a seat at this council. Aemond is my closest blood. King's Landing is through the Riverlands. We must establish a toehold there. Lords will either declare for me, or they will meet Vagar and Sunfire together. <laughs> we can burn the blockade while we're at it. Rhaenyra has dragons as well. Mine are bigger. Lead cautiously. No. Fat old Lord Tully will either raise my banner or see his burn. We should fly to river. Gar is needed here to deter Rhaenyra from attacking, in retribution for the death of her son. ...were made in the hours following King Viserys' death. Now favour patience and restraint. <laughs> I send ravens by the... Grace. Good morrow, Lord Laris. 
I come over Fuck to work this guy. For small camps. What is it you wish to discuss? You think? May I want to see some feet? They produce rather interesting details, but I am satisfied. What of them? They no longer breathe our air. Chosen your new staff personally. Give me that. Just leave, just leave, just leave me. Lord of the Seven Tecta of the Realm. Hail King Lies Aegon. upon lies. Good morrow, my, uh, Your Grace. <laughs> it's all right. There's no reason to be nervous. Ock. A, a, a tenth of them taken. The crowd. Time to plan. We should Perhaps. return them. Your Grace? Well, you need your goats for the winter, don't you? Sheep. You'll make your flock of sheep whole. <laughs> But he made a promise to all the crown lands that a type we could just return his sheep he came all this way if you return one herd of sheep all at the foot of your throne expecting the same they won't know the king speaks your crown. all hear it that's real after further thought i have decided that i cannot restore that if really more to break out my dragons will require fee to your grace we rely on ships from Essos for our supply. Blockade in place and war threatening. That treasonous blockade won't last long. I plan to send Vagar to burn it to ash. Hugh, Your Grace. Smiths are all proud to support Your Grace against Rhaenyra. But costs have grown. A lone scorpion takes weeks to build. But simply, we are struggling. If the Crown's coin before we started work, it would bring great relief. You shall be paid, and paid well. Our victory depends on the efforts of the small folk. You have my most sincere gratitude, Your Grace. Your Grace, it filled my heart to see you on the Iron Throne to see. But you brought forth memories of him, and you're such a deft touch with the small folk, just as your father. Did you have a moment for a quiet word? No. For you? No. Tis the hands want to keep a firm grip on things. Told your father the same way. Ceres had a certain reputation as being pliable. I am aware. Yes. I would think. As we find ourselves standing, that you would wish to be viewed differently. How? Oh. Otto Hightower was your father's hand. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. Daughter. I requested an audience hours ago. I find myself wondering do we pursue the same end? I must admit there are days where I myself can't be sure. Tell you mine. It's victory. How would you define victory? Rhaenyra bending the knee, and Aegon sitting the Iron Throne in peace. There is wished. Well, if that's how you describe Then be my ally. I like the peace part. I am. And there, and I feel your anger. Frustration. These critical days since Viserys is passing haven't gone to plan. My sons both see you as the great example. The hand to three kings gone is ever eager to prove himself, and Aemon... Aemon is angry. His son took his eye and was never punished for it. What he did... However vicious. Mr. Erd. But he is fiercely loyal. He wishes to please. If you undermine my voice, both those boys will grow deaf to it. I hadn't seen it that much. To mind, Egon, until the novelty of rulers. He tires of it. You and I can steer our course to victory. A fine strategy must accept that the path to victory now is one of violence. But that does not mean it must be wanton. You. When last we met, there were two of you. Quite well. Did you think I would wither in your absence? 
I did not think you would flower a trait. Have you been selling secrets to Otto Hightower? As long as he had gold to pay for them. Don't you flee from King's Landing in such distress to put Egon on the throne? That was the Hightower's conspiracy. I merely profited from... Simply spread the business along. Business that ended with the theft of the Queen. You blame me because your true enemies are out of reach. Arrangement with the Hand was purely transactional. I held no loyalty to him. The High Tower was to me as I am to you. Fodder to be cast off. What else do you know of him, his plan? This is nothing of value to you, Damon. Have her moved to the cells. She is to be treated as a traitor to the Crown. Me, my prince. But the lady speaks the truth. She was no agent of High Tower. Your Honor. Was it honor that made you stand by and watch as the high towers usurped the throne? Shame by it. That's why I abandoned the King's Guard. And my brother. Egon was in your grasp. You should have killed him yourself. Harry and I were named to the King's Guard. I just ate. wore the same oath, then the whole of the royal family. So what were we to do when they turned against one another? And the first men. Ready to the up kingdom. Now. Grieved enough, we've seen enough. Did you find what you needed? Let's go. Let's go! Dad toehold in the Riverlands. Your Grace, my Lord Husband's blockade of the gullet moves into place. I want Aemond Targaryen. Yes, Queen! She gets what she Oh god. Oh god. Years as merchant of gossip, you surely accumulated spies within the Red Keep. I came with someone else, Damon. I was once in your thrall, but no longer. His action then. Your knowledge in exchange for your freedom. Keep talking. Your Grace, Lady Jane Arryn, has pledged her support in exchange for a dragon to guard the Vale. Lord Craig and Stark, just cry. Let like, I'm about. Oh my God. Thousand men. This is heartbreaking. Ew. God. Valerie Florence. Sarah's Targaryen. God! Dang! A tribute. I'm told you bear a mislike for the high towers. Fuck the high towers. <laughs> Worm said you're one of Egon's rat catchers. You must be busy. That castle positive. Heard the white worm were dead. Her ghost told me you were a betting man. Fighting pits, how deep your debts. I was also given to understand that you possess a unique knowledge of the Red Keep. Crap of rat's nest it is. I know them better than the shape of my own cock. <laughs> Tonight he's going to be your friend. You're to find and slay the Prince Aemon Targaryen. Silver hair and one eye. Should be easy enough to find. Oh, man. I understand he's quite good in a fight. You want to take caution. It's one half. We'll get the other when it's done. All right. All right. What if we can't find him? We castle would dare to raise Rhaenyra's banner against us. He would bring the whole of the crown land. We could petition the king privately to send us out. They would not want us for enemies. We could add their levies to our own. My brother is hostage to my grandsire and mother, and they tell him that a war of dragons can yet be avoided. Otto fears to upset the order of things. Alicent is simply Angry blames me for starting this war. After she plotted with my father's counsel to usurp his throne, her grace speaks with two tongues. Has a gentle heart. And Rhaenyra is a cunning spider. Long ago, she drew Alison into her web. 
intoxicated her. Not your mother's fault. She holds love for our enemy and makes her a fool. Bunch of fools in this one. Turn to your post, Lord Commander. I must have a word with the Prince. It would concern me, grandson, if plans were being considered beyond the ears of your king and his hand. Once myself. I only wish to serve my king and my house. You and Vega are the greatest single power in the realm. If it wasn't obvious before, it certainly is now. But there are many pieces at play here, some of which you can't yet see. <laughs> I promise well, well. you, Raymond, you must keep a grip on your impulses. You both know that your brother cannot. I'm hella nervous right about now. Bring the dog. Hella nervous. Be a symbol for the small folk as well as the nobility. Wait. Would always be Egon the strong, Grace the third. It's a king. I need to be both. I'm the king? Who gives a shit what they say? My brother at least knows his place. I can set him and his dragon on my foes at will. Keep your eyes I down. I need a style that demonstrates power. Strong one. Egg on the dragon heart. Better. <laughs> you can cock. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. How do we get upstairs? The royals live up there. Tough limits it is. Different group of rat catchers worked the up. You're a royal fucking prince. Where do you think we're gonna find him? You in the castle. I thought the rest was your bed. End you right here. Take the rest of the gold yourself. No way upstairs. I just don't know my way around. Show me. Back up. Come on, bro. <sighs> the royals live on this level. No one's here. We need to keep looking. Oh, no. Supposed to be up here. To my heart, bro. About to cut out my chest. Oh, Set a trap. Huh? For appearances. Huh. For the rats. No, son. This is tough to watch. <laughs> it's the other one. She's not going to give up the king's hair that easy. No. She's telling true. Hold him down. <laughs> Holy hell, that was brutal. So brutal. Helena, what's happened? They killed the boy. Fuck, that was a lot. Man, there we have it, guys. Season 2, Episode 1 of House of the Dragon. And God, I've missed this brutal show so much. That ending was tough. Very tough to watch. Very tough to hear all those sounds when J Jaharis was getting it. But, yeah. Everything about that was rough. Poor Helena. Just having, having to 
go through that having to point out which one it was. <sighs> Damn, dude. But yes, what an episode. So many emotions. So many thoughts going through my head. But I loved it. We are back and better than ever. Back and better than ever. Um, I, I absolutely loved the opening shot of Winterfell. Uh, it was so beautiful. Um, see, seeing the wall, of course. And uh, seeing the Stark. All of it. Yeah, I mean, all of that made my heart happy. Um, uh, seeing Rhaenyra just grieve and grieve and grieve and go through it and finally see what she needs to see get that closure there and yeah she was she stormed back with a purpose i do think the the scene with her son where they like both cried um they were like trying to be serious at first trying to like talk business and all that but they had to let it out oh my god that scene was heartbreaking the scene too with Alicent lighting the candle and um, saying Luceris was heartbreaking, hit deep. But yeah, Rhaenyra coming back and saying she wants Aemond. And we didn't get Aemond, but God, we we did get, we got something all right. Shout out to Damon for hiring those two dudes. Good job from him there, um, but just yeah, what a what a tragic ending this turned out to be. MVP, MVP for this one. Should we give it to Rhaenyra? Or we could give it to Helena. She she went through a lot. Pretty. Pretty good performance here at the end from her. Um, and the scene too, where she talked about not being afraid of the dragons, but the the rats. And you know, everyone was kind of thrown off by that, but damn. We'll give it to Helena, fuck it. Um, yeah, what a brutal ending for her. Once again, having to point out Jaharis. Um, the scene to once again where she talked about being afraid of the the rats um, early on in the episode, and uh, yeah, I think it was just a a good performance from her, especially here at the ending. But ooh, what a freaking brutal start! What a fantastic start! House of the Dragons is back, and. Can not wait for more. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching my reaction to this one. Hope you all enjoyed.